Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, I wanted to do a test today um, comparing the SS hood scoop, which uh, a lot of people don't think does anything, um, versus the uh, recent SSRA cold air intake that I installed. Um, so what I'm going to use for this test is a Supermax fan from Lasco. Um, and this hot wire anemometer, um, which is Bluetooth, so I can get readings um, with that th with that uh, meter um, at different positions within the car. So um, results are pretty interesting, actually. Uh, the uh, the hood scoop actually does function, believe it or not. Um, I tested it in different places. Um, I put it at the SLP lid. There's a little plug on the uh, on the lid that I uh, opened up, and uh, I put it there. I also put it um, at the bottom. I'll give you. Sh I'll show you guys here right now. I also put it here because um, this that this uh, meter is actually extendable, and I. Uh, put it down here and you'll see it in the video um, you get quite a bit of airflow coming through here from the hood scoop um, but when you take it and measure the airflow coming out through the filter um, which is what your engine is really going to see um, it's definitely not as good as the uh, cold air intake um, I'll show you the video with the numbers, uh, quite interesting, but uh, I mean, everybody knows that when you look up here, you've got four holes and some uh, weather stripping there to try to seal it off, but um, doesn't do a great job, but um, it really does uh, work just not very efficient. The cold air intake is uh, actually quite a bit better. So anyway, I uh, just wanted to spell some myths, um, put a little science to it. Uh, hope you guys find it enjoyable. This is the current reading with the fan at the cold air intake. This is the meter that I'm using. I do have this access, access port open because I want to do another test. Kind of With moving this anemometer to that port, to this port right here, and try to do the same test. So here is the anemometer right at that outlet, the SLP lid. And that's the current reading with the fan on the cold air intake. Next test, I'm gonna seal up this hole. I can feel a lot of air coming out of with the supplied gasket. Okay, here's another reading with the fan blowing at the intake. There is very little air coming out right now with that thing sealed off. Here's the flow rate with the gasket in place versus not in place. It is quite a bit higher. Okay, this is what I've got set up now. Yeah, it's a little ghetto, but at least it works. Um, the gasket here is on. That's what's flowing out of the, uh, the lid. Those are the numbers. Here it is again with the gasket taken out. As you can 
can see it's uh, quite a big drop. Okay, so there's the current reading with the hood closed. The gasket is back on. And the fan is blowing full speed. To the cold air intake. I'm gonna move the fan away completely. There's no airflow. Okay, so here's the current setup now. I've got the fan blowing full speed. This is now measuring at that little hole in the SOP lid um, with the gasket off. And you can see it's dropped down a fair, fair bit because there's a lot of air coming outside of the uh, the, uh, the lid, um, I think the gasket does make quite a bit of difference. Now I'm just going to move the fan away. There's essentially no air coming in. Now I'm going to move it, the fan, towards the, the hood. see that's what the reading is out of the hole that SOP lid. I'll move the fan closer. Try to get even closer. So you are getting a little bit functionality out of the hood. People say it doesn't work at all, but it looks like it does. I'm going to try to move it even closer. Here's where it currently is right now. There you have it. It does look like the hood scoop is functional. It's just not as efficient as the uh, cold air intake. I'll move it back down. The gasket is still off. The SLP lid, I'll move it down to the cold air intake. And it's all flows over 2,000 feet per minute with the gasket on, so I will be running it with the gasket on, so. So there was a setup on the last test. Uh, anemometer's there. It was measuring velocity coming out of this hole. And no gasket right here. and the Supermax fan for the test. Hey guys, I uh, hope you like enjoyed the video. Um, hopefully, hopefully it was informative. Um, maybe just spelling some myths about cold air intakes on this car versus the uh, hood scoop. Um, if you guys liked it, uh, uh, give me a thumbs up, uh, subscribe. I'm going to have some more content coming in. Try to Try to get some more useful things. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. And uh, yeah, we'll see you in the next one and have a great day. Take care.